Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the Modded Character Showcase. We are jumping in again and we are going to do another run as Samuel because this guy's a fun old guy. I think we're going to do uh, some tainted versions of him and also I want to try out Martha soon as well as I previously mentioned. But, ooh, a planetarium off the bat. Been a little while since I've recorded some Isaac. Been a little while. Uh, I, I basically backlogged all of last week and then kind of took a break for a little bit. It seems to be a good way to keep Isaac fresh for me, so I'm happy to be back playing it again um, and happy to have a key for my planetarium as well. Serpent's Kiss is not too bad for us at all, not too bad. In fact, does Malak Mott make us invincible? I can never remember. Uh, Jupiter, obviously absolutely trash, but I'll take it. Um, puts our speed to just abysmal levels. Um, just, a, just a very annoying. Ah, uh, no, really? Okay, so it does make me invincible, but I can't actually poison things with Serpent's Kiss due to it, which is a little annoying. I kind of thought that would work. Yeah, unfortunately, Jupiter here. I mean, it makes us look dumpy. That's, I guess, some sort of bonus to someone out there, I'm sure. But to me, it's it's kind of, kind of trash. <laughs> but we've got a, 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 a somewhat poison-centric build going on to start with, and apparently... That guy did give me a black heart, and I don't really know why. Peculiar. Very peculiar. Yeah, it's a bit annoying that I don't count as uh, being able to touch enemies like that. That would be uh, maybe a bit strong, but very fun. Maybe a bit strong, but very fun. And that's how I like things. But we are going to have to jump around with our dumpy and uh, see what we can get done. But yeah, I'd like I'd like to get something that makes this work um, with Serpent's Kiss at some point. Give me like a unicorn stump or something to, to go around bashing into enemies. That'd be pretty fun. Um, I would like that quite a bit. I still can't believe Jupiter like is the way that it is. Like, just make it so that the speed regens a lot faster than it does. Because at the minute, it, it, it just makes it so difficult to actually use. Basically, it's like, oh, do you want to stand still a lot? No. No one in the history of Isaac has ever wanted to stand still a lot. It's offensive to me. I think I just got an email as well. You probably heard that. Uh, maybe you didn't. I, I never really know what comes through in the recording. I think that I think all audio comes through. Right, let's check in here. Bag of crafting. This is a bit of a weird one. Okay. I did not mean to do that, obviously. I'm just used to bag of crafting being a... Uh, Something that I would use on my Q button rather than my spacebar, so I accidentally pressed the wrong thing. But there you go. But I am infused by uh, by the bag of crafting. I think that could be pretty intriguing, pretty fun. Um, I haven't done a bag of crafting run outside of obviously being tainted cane in quite some time. It's been it's been a little bit since we've done one of those. So we could get some cool stuff going on and and craft her up a storm. I did it again. I did it again. I'm just going to keep pressing Q by accident whenever I want to use bagger crafting. It's going to keep happening. I apologize to everyone for my wastefulness. My god. But yeah, I'm always like this with Isaac where it's like, it's just fun to have like a nice proper break and then um, get back to it after a little while. Just I had a really nice chill weekend. Um, me and uh, a bunch of friends got together and... Went for a meal. We went and had ramen. It was very, very good. Um, and then just came back and had drinks and stuff. And uh, yeah, it was it was really nice. It was really nice. Ooh, it's a contraband, man. And it's the good contraband that I can take with me as well. Beautiful. What do we get? Ah, a sack produced a different sack. <laughs> Not a bad sack either. Not a bad sack. But it's pretty funny to have our, uh, <laughs> our sack produce a different sack. Okay, apparently swiping these guys stops them from charging me. I did not know that. That is news to me, but makes uh, this guy pretty pretty untouchable by these guys, which is pretty good. Uh, heart container is converted into three. Oh, that's actually pretty saucy. I think what I'm going to do is pop in here. Take our spicy bit of Damocles. Yes, please. Why the hell wouldn't I? And I'm going to take this and get a bunch of HP. Okay, so we've got Damocles now. I don't know if producing an item with Bag of Crafting will activate Damocles or not, though. I'm unsure of how that interaction works. But we'll find out, I'm certain. 
We did get ourselves straw man, which I don't think is great for us right now, but thank you for giving us straw man, I guess. He's fine. He's fine. But yeah, I have a feeling that uh, Bag of Crafting, unfortunately, won't be affected by Damocles, which is a damn shame. Okay, straw man, can you please just die? You are absolutely useless. Like, if, if you build your run around him, he can be fun, but otherwise, just, just let him perish. There you go. He's just in my way. I'm sorry, you, you, got, you went straw man. You are essentially just a bomb to me. The item gives you plus one bomb, and that's kind of all I got from it. But I'm happy enough with those results, to be honest. Trying to stand still as much as possible to charge up my farts, but it just just doesn't work, man. Um, that only counts as one, are you kidding me? It's like eight hearts in that bitch. <laughs> well, there's two doubled items, and we did get a little another sack there of... Uh, an interesting variety, so we are kind of a sack boy right now. We are Mr. Mr. Bags. Not Mr. Money Bags quite yet, but we are Mr. Bags. Okay. I'm really curious to see if Bag of Crafting works with Damocles, because it would be pretty interesting if it did. Yeah, there's literally no way I was getting out of the way of that, so unfortunately Damocles has activated. This room was just nightmare fuel for uh, our slow ass. There's pretty much nothing we could do to escape it. In fact, there's nothing we can do to escape much, because this speed is just horrible. It does make two. Okay. Okay, that makes things better. That makes things better. But this is still bad, because, uh... At the minute, we have a pretty big issue. Mainly the fact that we have insanely low speed, which means that we're taking a long time to do stuff, and we have Damocles, which promotes not having insanely low speed, I think you'll find. Also, our damage output is not amazing at the moment. It's fine, but it could do to be a hell of a lot better than it is. Also, very big not into this attack with low speed. I mean, I just had to absorb that hit there. Do one and take the other. Right. Just keep going. I, I I honestly don't know how this run's gonna end, but I would bet that it's probably gonna be on Damocles. Curse of the Swine I've got right now, which is part of that little black uh, thing candle that I got, which I think I can pick up the money that these guys drop and grab stuff from it. Which seems pretty good. But yeah, bag of crafting is going to make me pretty slow, I think. Die, fool. I don't... Has anyone ever used the RC remote correctly? Like, in an actual usable scenario? Has it ever been used, pro pro like, properly? Oh, we got speed up. I didn't even... I didn't I didn't even pay attention to the fact that we got Roid Rage in there. Lovely stuff. Wow, two active items, both of which aren't of any use to me. That's fun. But these guys are going to be hella annoying. I'm picking up everything. I want as many items as I possibly can get. This is also a lot of fun for us. I missed. Oh god, this is going to take forever, isn't it? Please, rotten baby, save me from this purgatory. Okay. <laughs> this is such a weird run, man. What a what a way to, to, to have a... Reintroduction back into Isaac. It has to be this weird crap, doesn't it? Really, the penny had to hippity hop away, did it? I've lost a lot of HP, but I'm somehow still kicking it. Okay. You've gotta... You've gotta be kidding me. <laughs> the, this, the Tech X was right there. 
<laughs> okay, we'll, we'll, we'll roll it back on that one. That one doesn't really count, does it? But that's a bit annoying. That's an incredibly M early Damocles fall. Like, insanely so. And we just got Tech X, man. <laughs> that was rude. Oh, God. This is always happens, though, when I take a break from Isaac. I always come back and I play significantly worse, but hey her. It is as it is. Whatever. We'll hope that the item room provides... Gives us something. Excuse me, don't fucking jump at me. Hope that it provides something beautiful. I actually ended up watching the um, the TED TV show yesterday. Um, a few of the episodes of that. Um, do you know the, the film TED about... like it's, it's the Seth MacFarlane thing about a teddy that comes to life. And it's basically just Peter Griffin. Um, the films were, were okay. They were funny when they came out. But they're definitely like not great. But the series is actually really good. <laughs> um... Oh, that sounds just awful. So why not? And also, honestly, this little dude. This little dude's good stuff. Pop that disc. Nice. I gotta say, Stitches is pretty decent. I like Stitches. He can be a pretty good lad. Demon Baby is, uh, is here as well. I'm not entirely sure where he came from. One second. Right, let's continue on. My goodness, uh, getting this is going to be a pretty wacky one. Uh, <laughs> this, this little trinket here. I'm sure that we're going to have some um, some wavy caps going off here and there that are going to make the screen a little bit funkier. But it does give us some extra stuff. I honestly don't know where Demon Baby came from. Like, genuinely, I have no idea. Um, it seems to have appeared from literally nowhere. Um, so I am confused. We did just get Lodestone though, which I quite like. Yeah, I'm, I'm re- I've also got a Guppy's hairball too. Like, actually, what is going on? <laughs> what- what happened? Oh, hold up. Is it just a devil disc that I have on that hasn't run out yet? And is about to run out any second now? Because I do remember- yeah, there you go. As I do remember using a devil disc. There you go. There you go. Yeah, try and stay out of the way of these guys. Hopefully we can get a little bit more done this time than uh, Damocles just killing us instantly. But that was such a cool run as well. Oh, Balls of Steel is lovely, obviously. We very much like the Balls of Steel. I accidentally didn't use my uh, my little voodoo baby dolly to uh, get into the cash room over there. So I should probably go and do that. Can you just die, please? Thank you. Probably go and do that real quick. We actually have speed now, which is rather nice. A rather good addition to our run, if I do say so myself. And where are we actually meant to be going today? We could do the Beast, I guess. Beast would be a pretty interesting one. Or we could do Mother, which I think would probably be even more interesting. Wouldn't you say? I reckon even more interesting. So let's do that. But yeah, we are going to be dealing with a lot of wavy caps. Um, it's This trinket really doesn't seem all that worth it, but it's it's funky-wonky. And sometimes we like getting a little a little bit funky-wonky. Not too much. Not too much now. You only want a little bit. But it, it adds a bit of unnecessary, but sort of nice spice to a run. Ooh, I do like it when I instantly kill the respawned enemy. That does make me feel good. Yeah, I knew that shot was coming. And that one as well, Buster. Oh, I was really hoping, really hoping the troll bombs would hit him. Turns out they hit me. I love the way you can, like, bop him about. Easy. Absolutely wrecked. Honestly, range is not that bad here. I will check out the Devil Deal. Um, I did get in Mini Isaac error here, apparently. Ooh, hello. Piercing tears. Tears cause bleeding, which makes enemies leave creep. Yeah, let's try that out, and then we can grab Abaddon too. I'm intrigued by this. Let's give this a go. Let's give this a go. This seems like a weird combination, and obviously it is a little risky. But the bleed does work, which I'm very happy to see. Oh, that was kind of spicy of him. I'd like that to not happen again, please. Oh, we also get our sacrificial blood as well, which is pretty strong. 
from all of this. This is if we can live. Reaper Bomb is a great way to introduce us to more life. <laughs> he does a very nice job of, uh, of spawning stuff for us that will help us to stay alive. This is great. I'm liking this so far. I mean, Abaddon's obviously extra damage. We get the bleed on every hit, which seems really, really good. We got a soul heart in here, which is really, really good. Haha, <laughs> I willed it into existence. We also got this here, which I wasn't expecting. The Fool, the Emperor. I think we just want to go for the Emperor, to be honest. Emperor's the best one. Everyone knows that. Then able to not have to do the boss fight. Uh, we'll not have to do the floor and just do the boss fight on the womb is invaluable. Although we're supposed to be doing Mother, and I, I, I tossed that idea asunder pretty quickly, apparently. Apparently I didn't like that idea after uh, initially saying I liked it. I just decided, no, maybe, maybe I don't. This is craziness. There is a lot going on right now. Doesn't help that my screen's all swiggly wiggly. Really doesn't help. Oh my god, I'm getting hit by some like absolute dinks over here. Need to chill out, buddies. There's so much happening right now. Oh my lord. Okay, so this run might not last as long as I was hoping. I mean, like I said, I can hope, but. Malak Mott to take out the big boy. And we try for the boss on 1 HP, it seems a little risky. Um, it's pretty useful. Where's my Emperor card gone? My Emperor card went disappeared. Wasn't the best idea I've, I've ever had there. This is bad. But it's okay, because we killed him. And from it, we get the fireballs. Nice. Okay. Yeah, runs runs on the brink of extinction right now, um, which wouldn't be ideal, especially on a 17-minute video. My god, I, my, my videos just keep getting shorter and shorter, don't they? Um, the fireballs, I like the idea of. They respawn pretty quick, and they do good stuff. Just depends how long I can actually stay alive for. Oh, coming in clutch with the keeping me alive. Baby. That is what we're talking about. Sometimes this game just knows how to give me, give me love. Get out of here, you. We should try and take all the sacrificial blood we can. It is pretty goddamn useful. There's a tattered page there that I don't know how that spawned. I just wish they automatically used rather than having to actually use them, but it would make them very, very strong if that was the case. Beautiful. We got, um, Epiphora, I think, there? Oh, dude. Nice bit of Cashola there. Don't know if I'm ever going to use this Lover's card, but I feel like it's good, so I want to keep it around. But at the same time, I'm going to be picking up Sacrificial Blood so often, do I even want to bother with it? Like, sacrificial blood is just everywhere, man. <laughs> Absolutely everywhere. Undeniably so. Every corner you turn. Oh, dude. I took a lot of damage just then. Bee skin seems interesting. Especially with piercing and bleed and all that good, good stuff. I'm going to quickly go back over here. Oh, God. Wavy cap is... is, is Wigging me out a little bit, I'll be honest. But I, I I shall not I shall not repent. I meant relent. Oh, really? It's another Lodestone. I don't think Lodestone really stacks, but I'll I'll take it. Thank you. I don't actually think I've noticed Lodestone do basically anything. Um Nice. He gave me a soul heart. I couldn't have wished for anything more. I lost said soul heart immediately. Get out of here, you freak. Okay. Okay. We are once again back in the running. <laughs> and I apparently have permanent flight 
right now? Oh, no, no, I don't. It's just bee skin being weird. I always forget that bee skin makes you look like a bee, but doesn't give you flight. It's slight, it literally gives you wings, removes your legs, and makes you hover, but it doesn't give you flight. Who hurt you, bee skin creator? Why? <laughs> Why you gotta troll me like that? A lot going on right now. The shop shall provide once more. It has done in the past, and we know it will again. Ah, you bastard shop. Oh my lord. <laughs> that was nice. Got us off a booster pack here. Can't imagine this will be amazing. Um, ooh, <laughs> that could be a rather spicy way to potentially end our run. Queen of Hearts. What we got here? Teleport, super secret room. Let's go for the super secret room teleport now. I forget what this spirit does. Ah, we don't really care about that for now. It's cool, but I don't need it yet. Oh, I took the wrong thing. I'm sure. Oh, I, I kind of get it. It lets you get all the stuff from over the gaps. Okay. Uh, right. What else do we want from in here? First of all, let's check out this devil deal while it's here, just in case there's HP in here. There isn't, of course there isn't. Um. Oh, that's such a good item. I'd love that. We can't have any of it. How dare you, game? How dare you? Um, that's pretty goddamn good. So I think I think what we do is we grab this. We drop it out here. We grab this. No, we grab this. We do that. Yeah, then we still got this. And we've also got a... a Boatload of money now. Don't know how valuable our boatload of money will be, but it's it's not bad at all, is it? Not bad at all. Right. I can come in here and I can buy this. Whenever he's a pill, it slows enemies in the room. I use corruption to grab this. And then I can come down here and I can spawn a glitched item as well. This is Grants Bible tracks on collecting, use dressing rod, then deal. Okay. Doesn't seem all that bad. Seems kind of wacky. Kind of wonderful. I'm liking the bleed. The bleed is uh is doing some really nice stuff for us right now. Also a burn heart. Can you believe it? Hmm. I may have just ruined this run because I am noticing that now I have the dousing stick constantly equipped and I don't seem to be able to put it away. Which is intriguing. I can't even pick up items, but that's good. Oh wait, no, okay. I can stop by using stitches. Okay. Luckily, stitches saves the day. Shoppeth. Ah, oh, really? Just this goober. You see how the stick comes out with all of those? The stick is out, and then I can't swing, so I've got to do that. And it allows... Okay, we, we've got a way out at least. And it, The dousing stick thing, whatever it's called, isn't actually that bad either, so we can use it on occasion. I just don't want it to be our, like, our entire run, because you can make entire runs out of it, and I don't want this to be one of those. There's a lot going on right now. Just gonna be forgetting that I've accidentally got the dousing stick above my head sometimes. So I am gonna forget, as you just saw there. I kind of forgot where we're meant to be going here. Are we trying to do Beast at this point? I think we are, aren't we? I think Beast would be fun. But at the same time, do we really think we're ready for Beast? Our health is not, not great right now, and this is Necro 1 already, so... Not looking all that promising, but... Oh, I wonder what it is that makes Lodestone proc, because it doesn't seem to proc much, and then every now and again it just, it does. Bernie boy, high priestess to make this boss a little easier. Off a dousing stick. Stop. Lovely. 
I can't even go down without this. Stop bothering my life, please. <laughs> okay, we gotta try and find our um fool's fool rock. I was gonna say fool's gold rock then, but it's not quite the same. That's a lot of shops and such. Ooh, this is some good stuff here. This is survival is what this is. Oh my lord. I have never quite seen that happen before. <laughs> I got three health ups off a... Of... This can be really annoying, isn't it, Dowsing Stick? You're really making everything more of a pain. My goodness. Toy drum as well. Okay, this this room turned this run around. This room was it wasn't bad, but like it was on the verge of struggling, especially HP wise. And this room was like that. That room was like, do you know what? No, not not no longer will you live on the gritty never never. You can now <laughs> take your full potential and go. I very much enjoy that. Thank you, game. Oh god, those explosion guys have a. A rather large explosion radius. I'm just realizing now that B-Skin seems to work really well with a lodestone enemy. It sucks all the tears in towards them and bleeds the hell out of them and all that good stuff. Need that full card, thank you. Not leaving without that. Yeah, just keep our rod up and you can see that like the intensity increases over time and you just get puddles everywhere and light beams and eventually the enemies die. It's just, the problem with it is it's, it's very, un you're, you're not able to really aim. Um, and so it creates more problems because you just can't really sort of put forth <laughs> attacks onto the enemy you're near. You can sometimes get caught out because the enemy you're right next to, like this guy, just won't die. Sometimes they'll die very quickly, but a lot of the time they just won't die. You can see the stick, I mean, it, it, it is killing stuff. And it's nice to see as well that it is also applying all of our bleed too, I mean... Nothing to turn our nose up out there. Kind of like having a, a little free item that we can activate pretty much whenever we want. Come on. I, I think like it's more focused at the center of the room. So you just want to kind of want to bring them towards the center. We should probably uh, pop the sun card here. Just so that we know where we're going. I mean, we're already nearly there anyways, but why not? It is a bit slower, to be honest, than just killing them normally. Unfortunately, picking up a sacrificial blood does trigger it. So that's a little annoying. Didn't mean to go in here, my bad. Thought it was the right way. <gasps> Extra burn heart. Beautiful. I feel like it's Christmas with my bone hearts. Thank you. I don't know how the beast is going to... I don't even know if I've ever done the beast as this guy. I think I have, but obviously not a particularly easy fight with a very close range guy. We're going to get some extra range ups, I guess, but we can't exactly rely on the chance of getting more range ups. We have to actually potentially deal with the consequences of uh, having low range. But we're, like, destroying through the floors. Like, the room's pretty damn quickly. Uh, my full card is gone, by the way. Don't know when or where. But it is gone. It must have been when I had the sun card, right? The problem is, Sacrificial Blood comes up as a as a card on the minimap. It's, it's not ideal. It comes up as like a special card. Okay, thank you. I got it. Right, we can do this. I'm going to keep my stick up and running for now, because this might do good damage to the boss. Just with all the creep piles and stuff is what I mean. Nah, <laughs> this is terrible. Let's not. Is this red mum? No. I have just made her red by bleeding her. Yeah, I'm not doing great damage to mum right now. Good job we got our little burn boy, though, just producing shit for us whenever we need it. Lovely. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Missed that burn heart there. Pyro is obviously quite good. We'll probably take Pyro. Some fool card out here. 
and we will try our best on the rest of this run. I think we should be okay here. We've got a good run going on. I'm liking the fireballs too. The fireballs is a, is a pretty good item. Right, down we go. We've got one more item room to turn things around a little bit, which I think will work. I am hopeful that this item room... Ooh, tainted treasure item room. That's something I did not expect. Ow. That's pretty interesting. I think that's worthwhile, because we just don't need nine keys at the moment. I like the way it drops them on the floor as actual drops, too. Nice, so actually like tangible drops there. Um, but yeah, like every time we open a lock for a key, we get a random stat boost. I don't imagine that'll be a lot in the remaining uh, the remaining parts of this run that we have left, but there'll be at least one or two, so it's not nothing. And 99 keys just isn't very valuable to us, so... My god, dude. I am playing very trash right now. God damn, it's 25% chance, but it feels like almost 100% chance. It feels like literally every single room we're, uh, we're getting this chance to uh, use wavy cap. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. Wow. Keep a going, keep a going. I should be using Malik Mott a little more as well. I've not really been using that enough. And it is very good. Oh my god. Oh, we got Solomon as well. Solomon's quality four, I'm pretty sure. It's amazing. That's pretty amazing. Got some spurters here. <laughs> this is a pretty good one. I like that. <laughs> Create a ton of spiders for very cheap and then go. Here's our rooms that we can open. We'll see what the snap boosts end up looking like. Can't imagine it'll be anything great, but... Reflux always comes to me and uh, disappoints me, so I'm not going to take it. Now you... You could be fun. I'm just going to try this. Oh wait, it's not uh, active. Okay, I'll definitely take it then. I thought it was an active. Could be a B skin, I guess. I'm down for this. This is weird and wacky. Could be just what we need. Right, boss man, where art thou? We've got a card there. Ah, I just took the two hearts of damage. Funny to, to know that burn hearts stop you from... Like, I didn't lose my burn heart. I just took one hit of damage in the burn heart. we got Dry Baby from... I genuinely don't know where, but we got Dry Baby. He's here. He's joined the crew. <laughs> this run has become very strange. It's gone. Just get over it. Oh my god, the dousing. I've just got to not pick up any pennies or anything. I lost a burn heart because of you. How dare you. Just let me... Let me go. <laughs> hey! I lost a burn heart. I gained a burn heart. Oh, and it's gone. <laughs> as soon as it was uh, part of our lives, it was just as quickly taken away from us. Oh my god, this dousing stick thing is just some some fat old BS at the moment. It just uses it all the goddamn time. I just want to be at peace. There's a lot going on in these rooms right now. There's a lot going on. I mean, we're making quick work of the rooms, but I'm just very, very worried about our current HP and... Uh, what we have to do in the beast fight. I don't think I have the strength to do it. Super secret room? How does that even work here? Okay, it literally just teleports me to the end of the floor. I don't know if that's intentional, but... Like, I don't know if it was a random teleport that I just got lucky with, or what? Oh, that is a... That is a fat old emoji right there. Scared the emojis out of me. 
We gained Tech X. Oh, it's Solomon that's giving us random items. Okay. I was like, where, where the fuck did I get Tech X from? So we finally got our Tech X that we were owed before. It is here now. We are now the proud owner of a Tech X. I mean, these quick fire rooms are meaning this 25% chance is triggering more and more. There is so much going on with that D3 right now. Need to go away with your Godhead Aura bullshit. Okay. Sacrificial Blood. Honestly, Malik Mott in a room like this seems perfection itself. Why am I getting so many of these cards? How are you not dead yet? Oh my god. Okay. Three hearts left. Gonna say... Not super hurtful. Ow, I've walked into that man. I need to stay close to him to be able to kill him, but... I'm getting so many of these. Okay, I, I, I gambled. I should not have gambled. I am on half a heart currently. I did just get two random black hearts out of that, which I'm... Entirely unsure as to where they came from, but I'll accept them for whatever they are. Boss disc as well, why not? I don't know where this black hearts came from at all. Oh, what the hell? The poop slick maybe slide right into him. What's going on in here? Oh, <laughs> it's just enemies. Oh, wait, no. It's also a soul heart. Fucking dousing rod, can you please just chill out for a goddamn minute? Ah! Hello? <gasps> Hello? Hello? Red stew, you say? That's a pretty opportune time to get red stew, I'd say. Um... Dowsing Rod, can you please just chill out? So let's see what else I get for free. Is that too hard to ask? It's the piggy head. Fucking Dowsing Rod, please stop. Oh my god. Fucking Dowsing Rod, chill out. You don't need to do it every goddamn time. We get it. Look at the crocodile go! Look at him grow! Look at him go! Look at him grow! Oh, a soul heart. I like that idea. Take him out with bleeding. Soul heart, make sure we grab that. Thank you. Dousing rod doing its thing. Lovely. Wait, what? Okay, here it is. We need to go while we've got the extra damage right now. Use as much of our red stew damage as we possibly can, please. Oh, Max's head as well. Pretty goddamn good. A tinted treasure disc as well. I will take. No, I don't care about that at all. I like getting hit straight away, that makes me feel good. Okay. This has all gotten a little hectic, but things seem to be working out. The TV's dead at least. Right, Malik mot straight away into this. What the hell? How's that hitting, hitting me? God damn it. My oh, Malik Mott saved me. Beautiful stuff. Okay. We do get healed up to a certain amount of hearts when we go in here, so... We should be okay. I think we put us up to six, doesn't it? 
Yeah, I guess it gained some HP there. Okay, so you're saying there's a chance. I don't know what happened to you as I as you entered the room there, but certainly something. Just ah, I, I'm I'm having such a hard time just seeing and visualizing what I'm meant to be attacking. I'll be honest. Like ha like I'm just getting hit all the time because there's just so much shit's going on. Yeah, I got hit like a thousand times there. Uh, again? What the hell's going on here? Okay, so we're probably dead. <laughs> probably already established that we're going to die here. The moon. Something give me a bunch of soul hearts, please. Where, where have you gone, sir? What, what are you doing up there? I need that card. It got broken immediately. How am I still alive? I got healed at some point. I don't know what card that was, but it's gone. I'm so... This is, this is so, like, crazy. I just don't know what's going on. Apparently, eventually, if I keep hitting the enemies, I do get cards. And they seem to be able to save me, so... I'm gonna keep trying with that strategy. Oh, wait! Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I can heal myself with my bombs. I completely forgot about this. <laughs> I got Pyro. I was like, wait, I just got healed. Yeah, Pyro, you moron. I completely forgot about Pyro. Unfortunately, it's a little hard to blow myself up. The fuck? There you go. I can like sit a bomb on top of my own head if I try hard enough. What, in, what on earth is going on with the coins right now? There's like some sort of beam coming off my... It's like a little tongue look. This little pink little tongue thing. It seems to be producing a lot of coins. What the fuck is going on right now? I am unsure where I am. What's, what's going on? Oh, I'm up at the top of the screen. How'd that happen? I need this attack to stop now so I can heal myself. Where, where, where the fuck is my... I tried to heal myself. I just don't even know what... I couldn't find where the bombs went. Either way, that was chaotic as fuck. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.